Welcome Sagittarius. I'm back y'all with another video. So this is going to be for Sagittarius uh, for February. So take what applies and leave the rest, okay? If you guys are interested in booking a personal reading with me, that information is below. If you would like to order uh, my truth oil, okay? This is infused with clear quartz crystals. All right, this is the truth. You want to know the truth about a situation? You got somebody, you feel like somebody is lying or you don't know, you're trying to get the tea, this is going to be the one for you. I also have my mermaid oil. This is like a real flirty oil, okay? So this could be like for the singles um, that just want to, you know, get you know get out there and meet new people, okay? So all of that information, I just dropped four new oils on my website. So all of that information is going to be in the drop box below. And y'all can check it out after you watch the video, all right? So let's see what's going on with my Sagittarius for February. Let's see how y'all bring this uh, February in. Let me shuffle a few more times. Thank you for everyone who has supported my business um, and purchased from the website. You guys are greatly appreciated. Like, y'all just don't know. Y'all are so greatly appreciated. Um, what I'm going to do for the month of February, I'm going to choose five people um, from who has ordered with me because that's how I'm going to get you guys. Is I'm going to contact people via email. Um, so you would have to order, um, from the website in order to get in on this. So I'm going to pick five people, um, who have ordered something from my website. You either can get a free reading or you can get a free product. Okay. From the website. All right. So stay tuned guys. I'm going to be choosing the winner on the end of February, the end of this month. Okay. So it's going to be five winners. Five winners, okay? So you can get, either get a free reading or you can get a free product from the website, all right? So all of that information, guys, is in the drop box below, so you don't want to miss out, all right? So if this reading happens to resonate with you guys, make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe if you're new, all right? Sagittarius, let's see what we got for y'all for the month of February. Oh, we got the Queen of Cups here. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpios, the energy. So you could be dealing. I feel like some of y'all are feeling regretful. Some of y'all are feeling regretful of, of, about something that you said or something that somebody said. We got the Empress here. This is the Mother card. Um baby mother car baby you know i'm getting like a mother motherly energy or um a female here i'm getting female energy very feminine energy um let's see i'm seeing cancer's energy too cancer and pisces all right so let's see what we got king of wands you guys it's energy four of cups three of swords what's going on six of cups Seven of Wands, the Fool, Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, Two of Cups, and the Ace of Wands. It's like y'all are crying over spilled milk. You're trying to make someone see what it feels like. Okay, so let's see. Why is the king of wands here? Karunka and y'all disappointed. And y'all are sad about something. And it's about something from the past. Okay, so are y'all like don't have good memories about a situation? Why is the king of wands here? 
for the lovers. We could be dealing with the Gemini. Yeah, I'm getting like y'all not happy. Ten of Swords and the Sun. Y'all aren't happy about a situation here. Like, you're not seeing the good in a situation. And you're extremely guarded, okay? You're extremely guarded with your feelings, with the Ace of Cups here. You're waiting for someone to contact you or waiting to get the chance to tell this person, here you guys, this energy is. Um, you're waiting for the chance to speak to this person. Um, you want some attention from them or I'm getting like you want to be noticed by them um, because your, your mind is all over the place. We got the Eight of Swords and the Seven of Cups. You're not sure if they're if they've walked away. This person usually mess reaches out to you. <clears throat> and you're just surprised. Like you're surprised that this person hasn't reached out to you. So I feel like y'all are kind of like disappointed. Why is the lovers here? the world you can feel like this person is your soulmate and you just are disappointed like it's like a boundary here is set up with the hierophant and the nine of wands it's like somebody set a boundary and you're upset Why is the four of cups here? Let me let me find out. Okay. Something's on hold. We got the high priestess and the empress. Somebody is, could be real spiritual here. The high priestess and the empress, this is a spiritual person. Like, this is somebody who can, you could feel their energy um, or they could feel your energy. You surprised that they are waiting this long to I feel like y'all somebody is like not responding to you and I feel like you're upset. You just got some shocking news like you like what? Or you're surprised that uh they waited so long to reach out to you? I feel like you're ref you're trying to refrain from putting in any effort right now. Um, so I'm getting like you're trying to keep it moving. But at the same time, I feel like you're disappointed. Why is the hangman here? The knight of wands. Yeah, I feel like you want to see this person with the two of wands. And I feel like you're, regrets you're regretting something that you said. Yeah, yeah. You're regretting something that you said. So somebody put something on hold. Um, why is the Knight of Wands here? Yeah, like you're waiting for them to come back around. Because you're refraining from... You're trying to hold back from reaching out to them first. Okay, so Three of Swords here. The Moon. Yeah, like this is Pisces energy. Cancer's energy as well. I feel like you're hiding how you feel. But this could be how you really feel. Like, I'm getting that there's a... You feel burdened. You feel burdened by the situation. You're at home just thinking like, dang, this person betrayed me. <laughs> Cut me deep. Cut me deep. You're trying to figure out what's going on. Like, I, I'm just getting like y'all are like hiding how y'all feel. Where's the moon here? The Knight of Swords. 
Y'all are trying to run from these feelings. Y'all are running from these feelings, King of Cups. <laughs> y'all are running from these feelings that y'all have. Like, y'all are trying so hard not to care. But I feel like you do. <laughs> you can't help it. Why is the Six of Cups here? The Queen of Wands and the Chariot. Cancer, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. I feel like you're trying to occupy yourself with other things to do with the Seven of Cups and the Judgment here. Why is the Queen of Wands here? Four of Swords. You're thinking about reaching out to this person. But your intuition is telling you not to. You want to, though. <laughs> With the Nine of Cups. You want to. You want to hear their voice. The um, Temperance and the Ace of Cups. Like This is like a real soothing voice. Like You want to, hear, you want to talk to them. Because you miss them. <laughs> Whew, so y'all playing tough. Why is the Seven of Wands here back here? That's that, that tough energy. Like, y'all trying to resist these changes. Y'all trying to resist this urge. Y'all got an urge here. Y'all trying to resist. <laughs> there could be money involved with the Six of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles, and the Ten of Pentacles. You could have uh, been giving, very giving and caring towards this person. I feel like, um, what's the Wheel of Fortune here? I feel like this is your chance to show your other side. So you're trying to do that. I feel like you don't want to seem like I feel like you don't want to seem like you're calling too much or like you don't want to come off as needy or something to that nature. Okay, now we got the fool here. Y'all going to go ahead and take that leap of faith. We got the sun. <laughs> Could be dealing with the Leo or an Aries here with this fool card here. Okay. Temperance, nine of cups. Are y'all going to go ahead and take this leap of faith? <laughs> Ten of Cups, okay, so I'm getting like, some of y'all are like taking a risk or taking a leap of faith in a new start or trying to fix this, fix what's what's going wrong um, in this connection that you have. You know that this would surprise them. Um, you were waiting on this person to make up their mind. We got Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, this person could have ghosted you. Or you ghost. I feel like this person may have ghosted you. Okay. Now you're ready, you know, to get this to get it back rolling. You ready to get it back rolling. Okay, because you don't have no problem. You don't got no issues with this person. I feel like this person could have backed off from you and you just like, you know, trying to figure out why. Okay. Queen of Pentacles is here. Virgo Taurus Capricorn. Queen of Swords. Libra Gemini Aquarius. Okay, now, I, like I said, I feel like you could be dealing with the Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, or uh, Queen of Pentacles. Or this person, you feel like you got cut off from this person. You feel like this person cut you off and they're doing well, okay? Um, so, I feel like you in your feelings. I feel like y'all in your feelings. I'm just getting it. <laughs> I'm just getting it. Why is the Nine of Wands here? Yeah, like, why y'all holding back? Why y'all holding back in your feelings? Somebody may have said that they want somebody who is um, a business man or a business woman or an entrepreneur or somebody who has something, has like a, a nice paying job or something like that. Um, so maybe you decide to walk away or they walked away from you. Somebody here is afraid of commitment or afraid uh, of, like, rising up to that occasion. So, somebody decided to move on. Okay, now, with the Eight of Pentacles and the Temperance. Um, temperance is you guys' energy. 
I do feel like you're going to eventually put this effort in or you're going to allow this person to put this effort in. But I feel like y'all are holding back. Like y'all are holding back from this person. So this person may have ghosted y'all because y'all holding back. Why is the four of pentacles here? You holding back from this person may have made this person, you know, back off. See, yeah, four of wands. Your, your focus, see, yeah, see, and then we got the emperor and three of pentacles came back out again. This is somebody who is extremely stable, um, who is mature and working and building and, and, and wants to build an empire together. I'm getting like... Somebody wants to build an empire with you, but for some reason you're holding back, like you're holding back. This is also husband energy, especially with the four of wands and the, the emperor here. So somebody could be married. Is That could be the reason that this person or you is holding back. Two of wands. Okay. Somebody's holding back from making plans. I feel like you guys could be holding back from making plans until you get clarity. Okay, until this person reaches out to you, expressing that they miss you before you invest or put your money in. King of Pentacles and Ten of Pentacles. Yeah, definitely. Now, how others are viewing the situation, how this other person could be viewing the situation is the Nine of Swords. We got the Five of Wands. So this person is um, maybe having their own little issues going on um, that they have they are focused on. I'm getting something here about regretting a decision. We got the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, I feel like they could be going through their own little battles here. Why is the Five of Wands here? The strength is Leo's energy. They could be battling um, some type of anxiety. So they may have anxiety issues, okay, and they may want you to stop telling, they may want you to stop telling, telling them your problems, and maybe you're not listening to what they have going on, so maybe they stop communicating with you, okay, because they may have felt, yeah, I'm getting somebody got ghosted, the hermit and the six of swords, somebody, somebody definitely is on a hiatus, okay, now we got the two of cups here. And your hopes and fears. Oh. Two of Cups, the Eight of Swords, and the judgment. Like you were hoping that this is a connection that you want. I feel like this is something that you wanted to stick. Okay. You may be uh wondering if this person is like uh how are they doing financially, or you're wondering if this person is just after your money. Um, why is the judgment here? Yeah, three of pentacles. I feel like there we go again. King of pentacles, ten of pentacles, and the three of pentacles. Like somebody here is definitely working on building something, building their finances up. Maybe you thought that, uh, maybe this, you thought that your person had this understanding. Maybe you thought that your person had this understanding that you were working on yourself or building something here. Maybe you felt like you made that clear. Why's the Ace of Wands here? Justice could be done with the Libra. But your intuition is telling you that maybe this person is mad and is over with the Ten of Swords and the Eight of Cups. Surprise. You're really surprised. Like, you're really surprised. You're hoping that you get justice in the situation. Okay? You're hoping that you get uh, justice out of this. Maybe you're watching this person on social media. They really haven't been posting. 
Yeah, and I feel like you're also hoping that this person reaches out to you. Like, y'all really hope that this person reaches back out to you. Because you are extremely surprised. Like, you're surprised that they have not reached out to you. Y'all are so surprised by this. Like, y'all must be talking to this person every day. Yeah, but I feel like uh, either this person is going to pop up out of the blue and and message you or you're going to go ahead and take that leap of faith and reach out to them okay to try to balance things to try to balance it out okay i feel like you're trying to open up of several streams of income or revenues with the two of pentacles and the ace of pentacles here and maybe you guys are business partners or you talk about business all the time um but i feel like y'all want to y'all want to uh Y'all want to go sneak off and do some, do, do, you know, fun things. But I feel like for some reason, you guys may feel like you're going to regret a decision. What is this? Why is the page of wands here as well? The magician. Somebody's making somebody want to go do other things. So maybe this person is making you feel like I just need to walk, look, walk away. And go do something else. Go occupy my time and do something else elsewhere. Since they're not offering me anything. They aren't. <laughs> they aren't responding. They're not coming. To, you know, y'all. Y'all got to let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right. Don't forget, guys, if you're interested in booking a personal, all of that information is in the drop box below. As well as... If you want to purchase from the website, okay, I got you guys a 20% off code there as well that you can utilize um, on the website. And I'm also picking five winners, five lucky winners um, at the end of the month. You have to purchase from the website um, because I'm going to reach out to you guys via email. You're through the website. You have to put in your email address, okay? So I'll be reaching out via email to five lucky people. Um, you can either get a personal reading with me or you can get a free item off of the website, okay? So check out the description box below, guys. I will chat with y'all later. Ciao.